The Antikythera Shipwreck Exhibition at the National Archaeological Museum is one of those temporary exhibitions that really shouldn't be missed. It's a fascinating collection of findings from a ship that sank off the coast of the island of Antikythera in the first century BC. The shipwreck was first spotted by a team of sponge divers in 1900, who began to retrieve as much of the ship's cargo from the seafloor as they could, although recoveries were severely hampered by the antiquated diving suits of the day. These 2,000-year-old artifacts give us an intriguing glimpse into the culture, technology and economies that shaped life in the late Hellenistic era. The ship's believed to be a Roman trading ship, sailing in Greek waters around 80 BC. These remains of the hull planks show that the ship was made of elm, which was often used in Roman shipbuilding. From the amount of cooking utensils and storage items, we can see that this ship was completely self-sufficient, carrying everything from olives and snails to basins for grinding seeds and bowls for liquefying vegetables and herbs. The ship's cargo attests to the existence of a burgeoning trade in art, then new in the Western world and the beauty and quality of the artworks and luxury goods show cultural sophistication and much disposable wealth. The wreck's most famous find has to be the Antikythera mechanism, which is the earliest preserved portable astronomical calculator. Originally thought to be one of the first forms of a mechanized clock, or an astrolobe, it has been called the world's oldest known analog computer. Seven large fragments and 75 minor pieces have survived. Their exact position and the original structure of the mechanism are still a matter of intense investigation but we know that it contained at least 30 gear wheels, as well as dials, scales, axles, and pointers. The Greek astronomical inscriptions on the surface of the mechanism refer to astronomical and calendar calculations, while the inscriptions on its metal protective plates contain instructions for its use. As you can see from this reconstruction, the mechanism was protected by a wooden case, which had a bronze plaque on the front and the back. The Antikythera Shipwreck Exhibition at the National Archaeological Museum has turned out to be one of the museum's most popular shows ever. There are still opportunities to catch this fascinating collection, as due to the incredible levels of interest in the findings, the exhibition's run has been extended for another six months and is now set to close in January 2014.